Mr. Bennett 81 here with a I guess how to video if you got the pieces or could get creative with what minifigs you have and build a, a leprechaun since St. Patrick's Day isn't too far away I thought I'd try my luck using what what many figures I have and put one together. Going to use the banana dude here from the mystery packs. Use the green shirt he has or the torso area for him. Figured I'd use the uh, torso for the leprechaun. The uh, head from this dude from a Lego City build. Legs from uh, one of the DC Mighty Micros figures. And for fun, the top hat from the penguin for a little extra fun. Let's see how this combination will look. Here he is, all put together. Figured the uh, Lego City guy would look pretty cool with the, the beard here given uh, the leprechaun the right look to him perhaps now for penguin's hat The only thing missing would be the pot of gold. Well, look. One pot of gold. Uh, the uh, pot, oh, uh, cauldron pot right here is from, uh, I think, the uh, Monster Fighters uh, Lord Vampire's Castle. But look pretty cool, and a bunch of uh, gold-looking studs for the pot of gold or gold coins. There is a few towel or towel-like pieces in there as well. They go with the stud pieces. But mix it in for, as I said before, the gold coins. Something for fun. And just using uh, what minifigs I had for this little build. If y'all want to give it a try, go for it. Make your own leprechaun. Feel free. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Till next time. Before I forget, got the idea from uh, the mini page that's in the uh, local newspaper. Topic was uh, on leprechauns. So I have some fun uh, with the idea. Not to mention Lego has done a minifigure in the past. So have a good one and uh, happy St. Patrick's Day.